Hi, Addictinistas! Clara here. Welcome to the channel, Public Shopping Addicts. So nice to have your company and thank you for stopping by and hanging out with me today as I uh, do this PSA for all you. I hope everyone is doing well and uh, yeah, and hanging in there and welcome to the month of August. Uh, let's see. So yeah, so today I'm actually going to do uh, a few PSAs. I'm probably going to do three today. I'm going to try to put out two um, probably at the same time. And then the third one, I'm going to uh, put that out in a few days, which is going to be worth it. So definitely uh, have that notification bell um, uh, clicked on so that way you know when I post that uh, PSA you will be in the know yeah so as you can see I started my PSA because I was drinking my coffee in this big old cup <laughs> I love this cup uh, if uh, if you checked out my Instagram page you saw where I posted this I actually picked this up at JC Penny this was when um, the same time that I picked up that cute little wristlet that Monday wristlet I also picked up this um, mug and it's so big and it holds a lot of coffee and I mean is there such a thing as not enough coffee because I need a lot of coffee I, I love coffee I say and uh, yeah so this is actually from the uh, this company I actually have dinnerware from them and they are really good it's a German I believe German company and they have been around forever to this day I probably can't even pronounce them correctly Fasselgraf if I'm not mistaken but yeah so um, I wanted to see if they had it at JC's Penny's website but I didn't see it um, and they only have basically like three when I picked this one up. So, yeah, but um, I thought I'd give a little show of my latest uh, coffee mug because it's always fun. So, you see this beautiful bag behind me? Yes, that is what we're going to do today, my thick Denistas. Um, I wanted to uh, do a reveal of my lug jumper which I haven't been able to really, uh, I didn't do an unbagging, you know, pretty much lug when they ship things. They'll just pretty, pretty much either put it in a bag or a box, um, but easy breezy. So yeah, so I wanted to do a uh, what's in my bag, the puddle jumper, not the puddle jumper, the lug jumper, because they do have a puddle jumper, but this is just the lug jumper, which is basically a lot I have referred to um, it. And it's probably true, it's like half the size of a puddle jumper, basically. But it's such a great bag and I can't wait to get into details with it. So uh, before I show you what I have inside this bag, I am going to show you the other bag that I picked up as well in the jumper because I did pick up two. You know, I, I have to have two. I can't just have one. So this is my bouquet pearl and I picked up another one in camo rose. You have seen this pattern before because I have this um, in the the wallet, the, the split XL, right? The split XL. And I have it in something else. I have it, I think, in the roundabout too. I also have it. And oh, in the kickflip uh, three, dare I say? I can't remember. I don't know. They, they've come out with a few versions. I think it's a kickflip three in camel rose that I've also uh, showed on one of my PSAs. So uh, let's take this one out of the bag because I want to show you some of the details to the jumper uh, before I get into this because this one is packed. I've been using that this bag for the past week and a half um, primarily for shopping and running around and doing things and I have to tell you it is the most comfortable easy going bag that I have used and I love it. I don't even know how I can get out, get away from this. I, I, I know I have to switch because I really want to rotate some of the stuff that I have, but I love the way this has worked out for me, especially for shopping and going about town and doing my thing because it really pack, packs a lot and it, it's not even heavy. But anyway, so let me show you the Camo Rose. So this is the Camel Rose, and this is the jumper. And of course, it comes when it comes to you, it's gonna come folded like this, but that's okay. It's it's a nylon material. If you're not familiar with lug, they're mostly um, nylon bags. Very good quality quality nylon bags. 
very pretty. As you can see on the back side, we'll start, let's start on the back side. On this back side wall, you have a zipper that goes all the way from end to end. And this is the interior pattern of the uh, camel rose. And look how cute that is, that is so pretty. And it's a really nice size, um, a nice size pocket. So you got this pocket back here, and then um, it does have these end pockets as well, which has a really nice magnetic um, snap to them. Like they really secure tight. So um, I recently used mine. Uh, I put an umbrella in there. It was on a rainy day, and I was able to put the umbrella here with no problem, and it fit very well. And you can also fit a water bottle as well, so that you can uh, use as if you wanted to. And then the front is basically, this is like the half size of the puddle jumper. You get the two cargo pockets. It's a little oversized than most most of the pockets that you would see on, on other lug bags, but um, it's a nice oversized pocket. It has the signature, I call this already, like the little signature envelopes, uh, envelope uh, slide pocket. It has a nice quilting in the front. And then it just closes like that. There you go, like just like that. And these pockets are really good to put little things in, which I'm gonna show you on my um, the bag that I, I'm using now. And then you have this um, signature pocket here, which is normally for the cell phone. It fits nicely in here as well. I'm using my cell phone, but my phone fits in here with no problem. My 10 plus that I that I use goes in there with no problem. And then um, you do have the main uh, zipper. And before we, you know, sh I, before I open this up, let me just show you the the strap. You get the double handle. And what I like about these double handles is it has a very nice rubberized texture. You see that? It's really, it's like a fine rubber. And I really like that. I wish all bags came with this kind of uh, rubber um touch to the to the handle because it keeps it on your shoulder and it's actually quite comfortable as well so it's not tugging in now this drop it, it's a little on the short side I would say maybe about uh, seven inches or so or maybe a little more because it does give a little give I mean I can put it over through my my shoulder it's a little tight fit but it's really comes in handy when I really need to like just plop it on my shoulder for some you know quick use of my hands I would with no problem put it on but I tend to carry it with straps that it comes with so I'm going to show you the straps as well but just to give you a tour of this bag um, quickly because I really want to show you what I have in the one that I'm using and then this is the inside uh, to the main compartment and what I also like about this bag I also want to show you well actually I'm going to get into that but let me just show you the the slip-in pocket it has one slip-in pocket and then it has these two loops for like pens it does come with this cute little bungee style uh, uh, leash and it has that beautiful gunmetal uh, hardware right there and then on this side it comes with a see-through uh, clear uh, zipper pocket which is really nice it's like a built-in cosmetic case I love that and then it comes with your little typical paperwork and here is the strap so you do get a really nice size strap as well that you could use you could use this as a crossbody if you want but you know to me it's a bit oversized for crossbody but you do have that option but it fits really nicely on your shoulder as well and then what I wanted to show you about this bag before I move on to my bag is the way this bottom is as far as storing, which it's another feature that I like about this. Um, when you want to store your bag, this actually lifts up. You see how that lifts up like that? So it lifts up from the bottom and you know, this is secure, but it lifts up. So when you want to seal the bag, you can seal it like this instead of fold it the way it came you can seal it like this which is really nice and then you can stack it with no problem and you won't damage the bottom um, uh, cardboard I guess because um, it's gonna be laying like flat like that you see so that's really cool and then when you want to use the bag you just push it down set it in and then there you go 
it plucks like no problem. And since I'm on this, let me show you the beautiful feet that it comes with. These feet are really nice. I just love that gold, I mean, not that gold, uh, gunmetal uh, color for the feet. It's really nice oversized, and I love that because definitely it will protect your bag. Sometimes these bags this size, you might want to put it on the floor, which is, I mean, if you have to, I get it. Uh, I normally try not to, but it's really nice that you have these uh, feet options, so it protects your, your feet, uh, it protects the bottom of your bag. Really, really nice. So yeah, so this is the uh, camo uh, rose, and now we're gonna do a what's in my bag, the one that I've been carrying, which is the bouquet uh, pearl, and this is my my beautiful bouquet pearl. Let me just show you the uh, color. It's a beautiful. Uh, it's a really beautiful gray color. I mean, true gray with these beautiful um, bouquets that are, um, it has yellows, it has these beautiful like blue teals with the green as well. And I love that pop of yellow and, and of course that very pastel kind of white on it. And it's so cute. I love the placement on this one because I got some really cute flowers here and here. But uh, yeah, and it's, it's stuffed and um, I have to tell you, it fits a lot and it fits as little as you want. Somebody had referred to it as a big small bag because basically it it looks big, but no, it looks small, maybe small, but uh, it packs a lot. I mean, it packs a lot, but it doesn't look over overbearing on, on you. It looks like a really nice, fashionable handbag. If that makes sense I mean I love it I love everything about this um, I'm gonna note the size for you because it has a really nice uh, uh, the, you know size to this I love the size of the of the depth to this it has uh, a lot of uh, space that's for sure let me show you the bottom of this one as well so you could appreciate that beautiful uh, pattern I mean this pattern is just so so pretty so yeah like I said I, I really have enjoyed I carry both I carry this and of course my strap I have it set to the shortest so that way it doesn't hang too long on me it hangs just uh, right where I need it to be so yeah so let me just plop this over here to give you a quick show of the stuff that I have um, I'm gonna try to do um, the best that I can on my desk on my work desk here but um, I'm gonna start with these two pockets in the front I love these oversized pockets this has really come in handy these little um, envelope pockets have come in handy for holding receipts which I have gone bonkers shopping I went to JC Penney and uh, I did a bit of shopping there and I stick my receipts in here so I have my receipts in there let me just and I'm gonna empty this out because I'm gonna probably move on to another bag so if not maybe I'll move into the camel rose because I like that camel rose all right so here I've, I've used for my receipts I also will put in here like um, if I park in an indoor garage I'll put my parking ticket in here as well um, beautiful zippers with my favorite hardware right there love those hardwares i love when they use that that teardrop hardware and then on this pocket let me show you the, in the inside to that so on this side you got the pattern and then on this side you have this cute pattern this is the interior pattern to bouquet pearl so in here and i'm just going to throw everything into uh, onto the uh, bed here i have my more receipts and I have my cloth to clean my glasses, and I have my uh, ear pod, ear pods uh, in there, and that was pretty much everything I had in there. And then in this pocket, I kept my house keys, which you have seen on a previous PSA. My coach uh, keys, my my key case there, and that was it. Pretty much, that's everything I had in those pockets. I usually have my cell phone in here with no problem fit beautifully and then on the back side before we get into the into the main compartment in this zipper what I kept in here I kept my car keys which you have seen 
I keep my key fob, my car key fob in here in my love uh, Kipling case. And let's see, and I also had some, oh, this is a, actually a prescription because I went to see the eye doctor. And that was it. Basically, that's all I had in that pocket. And then we are going to move on to the front. And before I go there, one thing I did not show on either bag, what makes this bag so good also, it has a double, I call it the kiss, kiss zipper. It has that two zippers that can meet right there. Isn't that really pretty? Look how beautiful that hardware is. I love Lugs hardware. I can't, I, I always say it in every, in every, video i mean let me just show you the buckle as well look how pretty that is and it'll say lug very pretty and the same on the other side yeah so um it's really nice that it has that option to use that you can use um the zipper i usually keep it on one side especially like when i'm shopping i'll just keep it like one side closest to me and then let me just open this up so you can see the inside isn't that a lot of stuff in there this is everything i've been carrying and it fits a lot of stuff you can fit as much as you want as little as you want and it feels like really really good so I'm gonna start off with the clear pocket because it makes sense to start there so basically in the clear pocket you can see my potpourri and this is hand cream so let me just open this up and pull these out so I have my potpourri, which is a full-size bottle, and that fit in there with no problem. And I also have um, hand cream as well from this company. This is really good. This is like an avocado base. Um, I think I got it from Ipsy, if I'm not mistaken. But that one, that that's my hand cream. And then on this pocket here, let me go on this side, which is that one big zip. I kept my reading glasses. And I also kept my um, case that has my it has a pen and my nail file, and also my flashlight was there, my Dollar Tree flashlight. So that's in there. And then let me show you what I also kept on the bungee, uh, the key leash. I kept the little coin coin pouch. We've seen this coin pouch before so what I did I attached it to the bag and what I have in here is a uh, hand sanitizer so I have a Bath and, uh, Bath and Body Works hand sanitizer and I put it in here and then I just attached it to the bag so I'm just gonna remove that because I will probably use this on another bag maybe I'll use it on the camel rose I'm not sure because I really like that camel rose and then that, that pretty much takes care of that in terms of the pockets and then in the inside I kept my um, glasses these are my glasses that I use for distance so that I have there and I also have my uh, Kipling wallet this is the wallet I've been using this is the money love wallet I love this wallet I I need more of this wallet that's all I have to say <laughs> so I'm on the hunt for more of that and then the rest that I have is, oh, pouches. Oh, I have an extra mask that needs to be washed. So that's gonna go over there. I did also carry my Eco Shopper. Um, you've seen the Eco Shopper before. Actually, I have it in tiles uh, teal, which um, I did in a giveaway. Um, so um, that you've seen, but this is the one. This one is in bouquet, bouquet red, which is actually, this is bouquet pearl and this is bouquet red and they also have if we're going to talk about bouquet they have bouquet blue and they have bouquet black if I'm not mistaken which I'm gonna show you oh sorry I hit the thing the phone but I do have bouquet black right here as well so this is bouquet black in the splits uh, X wait is this the splits XL I'm so confused no this is the tram I don't know where my brain is at, but yes, I blame it on the heat. <laughs> I keep saying split XL. This is the tram, and this is a bouquet black. This is bouquet red, and I'll just put that there for now. And I love these um, eco shoppers. They really pack a lot, so 
you just want to see quickly what a, a you know bouquet red looks like in the eco shopper this is the eco shopper so I carry this because when you go shopping you need your own uh, bags to fill so that's in there and then the rest of the stuff that I have are pouches and um, I'm gonna start off with this empty one this is an ipsy pouch but I kept this pouch uh, a lot of pouches I'll tend to give away or donate maybe but I kept this one because as you can see it's silver based so this is my snack pouch and especially when I am shopping with my mom um, I need to take snacks because she gets hungry and she thinks I'm a convenience store so I'll pack this like with almonds nuts and uh, maybe some fruit bars and things of that nature. It's empty because she ate everything, <laughs> but it was worth it. Uh, and then I do have my extra mask that I take with me. And um, I have this pouch also, which has some hand wipes. Uh, this is also from Ipsy, which I love this one because it's, that, uh, it's plastic. So I like the fact that it'll keep everything in here. You know, I don't want the water to seep out or anything like that and then the last thing I have are these two pouches uh, which you've seen before you've seen this one uh, this is in uh, I believe the dragonfly multi if I'm not mistaken I think this is the medium size and basically what I have in here is like toothpicks uh, tissue and some uh, toilet seat cover oh and then I have an extra um, hair scrunchie right there and then this one is from the latest this is actually um, I'm gonna note the name to this but this is relatively new this is from a pack of two this is from a pack of three this is from a pack of two this is in rose wood if I'm not mistaken in the, in the color and basically what it has is like my leave and my little emergency kits it has my sugar um, a lip balm some lip gloss lipstick and let's see what else oh it has a mirror and some uh um, some breath uh, breath strips so yeah so that's everything in here and that pretty much is everything that i had in my bag so all this was all in my bag and um not to mention i did plop like i said an umbrella here one day and uh, my sunglasses can't fit in here but since I was traveling by car, my glasses, my sunglasses, I, I, I keep in the car, but I could put it in here as well. But it's such a nice bag. So I, I, I'm telling you, it's really a great bag. I love it. And I look forward to using Camel Rose. Um, I don't know if I'm going to do any mod shots. Um, I did post a pic on Instagram. So hopefully you saw that. If not, I'll, I'll put it here as well so that... Actually, what I'll do is I'll put it here. No, I'll put it here. I don't know where I'm going to put it. I'm going to put it somewhere so that you can see what the bag looks like. Uh, yeah, so um, the Lug Jumper, it's relatively a new bag. You can get this on QVC. You can get it on luglife.com. It comes in a lot of other patterns as well. And I do, like I said, I love that I can just fold this. I could just now lift this little portion up like that and then I could just fold the bag right in the middle just like that and for storage purposes I mean I could really just stack this up uh, with other bags on top and I, I'm not worried that it's gonna get wrinkled or funny looking or anything like that it's gonna really hold its shape uh, for a long time and it, it holds up pretty well I have to say um, I've been tugging at it I do a lot of tugging from the top and it has really hold up well and it is a comfortable bag so um, if you've been thinking about getting the lug jumper um, I definitely definitely recommend it I think this is one of the better bags that lug has come out with it's like I said very fashionable and you know I've always been a cargo pocket girl I'm talking about since the 80s so cargo pockets are not going anywhere and uh, it always retains its, its fashion um, and it's it, and, and the silhouette and everything um, it's like an oversized satchel and a mini tote put together and it, it has a lot of function and a lot of organization so yeah so um, that is my bag and um, I'm really glad that you got to see it finally because like I said I've been using it for the past week and a half and I 
I really am kind of sad to get out of this bag. I mean, I have other bags that I want to really, like I said, rotate, but I don't know. Um, she might, she might just keep me under her spell is all I can say. Or that camel rose that I just put on, on the floor. She's looking at me too. All right, Victinistas. So thank you so much for hanging out with me and stopping by and checking out this PSA for the lug jumper. She is a beauty. Um, hopefully when they put some, some on sale, I just might be tempted to pick up maybe one more. Though I am pretty happy with the two that I have because these are really great patterns that i can use all year round especially the camel rose i think it would look fabulous in the winter time to use with any of my you know oversized coats all right so until then addictsthenistas be well stay well love one another and i will check you out on the next psa which will be very very soon until then take care now bye